Hello guys, so for today, we'll be rocking out the VCB of a high voltage system and I will show you the step-by-step -step, um, procedure on how to rock out it properly in a safe manner and what are the things that needs to be considered before doing this kind of job. So come and join me in this new learning. Special gloves. We will need. We will wear. It's 7,500 AC maximum voltage. So this is the one that we will use. Okay. So we have special tools for racking out the PCB. First, this is the one that we use to rack out the PCB. And this is the one for grounding and ungrounding. So after doing permit to work, we need to block the operation of the generator so that it will not start automatically. Key is here and you just need to check which is the right key for the EG3 so it is the key 103 the key 103 will be the one who will be inserted here so that we can start rocking out the PCB So this is the indication that it says our VCB is disconnected. Now we can proceed to the next step which is to de-excite the system. the excitation key we need to excite okay alarm will come take the key and the key will be used for the grounding okay now after we put the, the excitation key then we can put the this handle for grounding so that we can earth the system see this one marking line so this one needs to do counterclockwise okay so now the system is earth we can remove this Okay, and then you can remove the key for the back side. This key is for the back side. So this key is for the back side so that we can open and check the condition of the wirings. We just need to open this. Now we can open this door. Okay. And we can take another key. So there is a key inside which will be used in opening the top side cover. Okay. 
those are actually voltage transformer the ones inside are voltage transformer so guys before doing this make sure that you earth the system well and you're following all the step by step I myself even I did it for so many times I still ask the manual I still consult the manual on how to do the racking out before I'm doing the job and I also make my own permit to work and uh, lock out tag out um, system so that we won't miss anything so these are the wires from the generator side and it will go to this feed so that's why it is important that we need to isolate also that one so that it will not start automatically So we just rack out the BCB for the number 3 generator put the stopper the red one oh, I can put that yeah so now if we want to put back everything we just need to reverse the step from the beginning up to the end so we'll take the key at the back put it there and then we'll take it from here then we will put this back to the grounding key section now we can insert the grounding bar the so we can and ground down. So after ungrounding, we need to put back the the ax, the ax, the excitation. So we need to put it in normal. So now everything is put back to normal, and we can wrap it in. This one must put in and it says connected. Okay. So 
So that's it guys. I hope you learned something from this video and I hope it will serve as a reference for you in the future. And please do not forget to hit the subscribe button for more ETO updates. Thank you.